The Apple Magic Mouse and the Logitech MX Anywhere 3S are great compact Bluetooth mouses, but they have quite a few differences. And in this video, we're going to discuss if you should pick the MX Anywhere 3S or the Apple Magic Mouse for your next Bluetooth mouse. Both the MX Anywhere 3S and the Apple Magic Mouse offer great user experiences. The Anywhere 3S has programmable buttons on the side, a clicking scroll wheel on the top, and also a button below the scroll wheel that can all be customized to do whatever you want with the Logi Options Plus app. The Apple Magic Mouse doesn't have a physical scroll wheel, but you can scroll both horizontally and vertically just by using your fingers on top of the mouse. It's a super seamless experience. The MX Anywhere 3S is a much more ergonomic mouse though than the Magic Mouse is. The Magic Mouse just has a very flat feel to it and your wrist isn't elevated or supported at all so it can get very tiring to use. It can cause wrist pain if you use that mouse for a long time. But the MX Anywhere 3S has a little bit better ergonomic comfort with some better grip on the side and it's just a taller mouse that feels better to use. The Magic Mouse is definitely smaller and more compact and will fit in your backpack a little bit easier than the Anywhere 3S though, so it's a better mouse if you're on the go and traveling a lot. The MX Anywhere 3S recharges with USB-C and the port is on the top of the mouse so you can plug it in and still use it even while it's charging. The Apple Magic Mouse has a lightning connector on the bottom that you use both to pair it and to charge it, and unfortunately it's on the bottom of the mouse, so if your mouse dies, you can't keep using it while it's charging. One of the biggest strengths of the MX Anywhere 3S is the multi-device pairing button that's on the bottom. This allows you to pair it with multiple computers, tablets, and you can just cycle between the different devices just by turning the mouse over and clicking the button to go between slot one, slot two, and three. So it's a great mouse to use if you have a lot of different devices that you wanna pair it with, or even just using with multiple computers at the same time. With the Magic Mouse to pair it to a computer, you have to plug in the lightning cable, and then if you wanna change it to another computer, you have to get the lightning cable back out, so it's a little bit more annoying to go back and forth between one device to the next. One big con of the MX Anywhere 3S is there's no built-in side-scrolling on the mouse. If you wanna use side-scrolling though, you can hold one of the side buttons on the mouse and then use the scroll wheel and it'll scroll side to side, but I find this feels a little bit awkward to use compared to the scrolling experience on the Magic Mouse. You also can't use gestures on the MX Anywhere 3S unless you program the Logi Options Plus app to click a button on the top or the side, and then you can move the mouse in a different direction to activate gestures. But on the Magic Mouse, it just works a whole lot better. One big win that MX Anywhere 3S has is the programmable side buttons, and these can activate certain functions like undo or redo or zoom in or zoom out, and you can control all of these through the Logi Options Plus app. You can make system-wide changes as well as application-specific changes so that you can make the mouse do different things when you have Final Cut Pro open versus when you're just browsing on Safari. If you're comparing the MX Anywhere 3S directly to the Magic Mouse, it honestly is a toss-up between which one you should pick out. The MX Anywhere 3S is a more ergonomic mouse that offers better functionality with multi-devices, but the Apple Magic Mouse just gives you a more seamless experience if you're using an Apple product. I really love the way that the scrolling works on the mouse and all the different gestures that allow you to change between apps and desktop windows. It all just works really great and has that Apple integration that we all know and love. I think I would pick the MX Anywhere 3S if you're using the mouse for longer periods of time and you need better ergonomics, as well as if you want to use it with multiple devices using the device pairing buttons underneath it. I would also pick the MX Anywhere 3S if you're really excited about having the side buttons that can be reprogrammed as well as the scroll wheel and the button under the scroll wheel that you can reprogram too. I would pick the Apple Magic Mouse if you want portability and if you want that built-in Apple support that just works flawlessly with the Apple computers. I love all the built-in gestures and the scrolling experience on it is just a little bit more enjoyable than using the MX Anywhere 3S. I have links to buy both the MX Anywhere 3S and the Apple Magic Mouse in the description below. And if you have any other questions about these mouses, leave a comment down below and I'll do my best to answer them. Also, be sure to check out my dedicated video review of the MX Anywhere 3S and the Apple Magic Mouse where we go into even more depth about all the different features both of these mouses provide.